Uh-oh, what happened? You're supposed to put the milk in after the cereal, Kip. Oh, I know, but that's so boring. I like to do things my way. Things always turn out better when you follow the directions, Kip. Even cereal. Old McCukin had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. I'm telling you, Jan, this could be great. It has all the signs of a homegrown success. Oh, I love your new job ideas, Dad. What's it going to be this week? So, here's the idea, Kip. Growing organic, free-range cucumbers. Genius, Dad. What's a cucumber? Okay. I think it could work, Ed. Have you prayed about it? Gardens need a lot of work. And we have lots of workers right here. What could go wrong, right? Oh, oh. Dad, let me help, please. Sure, son, but growing these veggies isn't easy. There's lots of steps and detailed instructions. I can do it, Dad. You'll see. Okay, my little chip. But do you think you can get Finn to help? With his brains and your energy, we'll get this idea up and running in no time. Sure, Finn's my best pal. He'll help me out with anything. Uh, Dad? Where are you going to grow these cucumbers? Oh, that's easy. There's plenty of room in the backyard. Once we move that old playset out of the way. Dad, I need that playset. I just got it all cleaned off and ready for my next pet delivery. They're due any day now. And I need that playset to help with their growth and development. Don't worry, Kara. We can figure out how to grow Dad's cucumbers and help your pets. Finn and I will take care of everything, Dad. This is going to be great. Okay, Kip. I'll go make you a list of jobs. Just remember to follow all the directions. I'll go get the InstaCell account set up. Uh, that is, if all this is okay with your mom. So, what do you think, hon? Well, I guess whatever we don't sell, we can eat. And I'm always saying the kids need more veggies. Ew! Cucumbers are vegetables? <gasps> Would you just look at all this? A mess, a complete mess. Nothing's done yet and everything's in a pile. Oh, for some silly cucumbers. Correction, we're growing cube cumbers, not cucumbers. What's the difference, Finn? Not much, technically. They're still cucumbers, of course, but with our special seeds, they'll grow into rectangular prisms called cuboids. What for? For better, uh, stacking and snacking. <laughs> Ugh, I don't care what you call them or why. But I do know one thing, Kip Cubekin. You'd better get my playset back together. My new pets are gonna need it. Kara, <gasps> package for you at the front door. It's my pet door delivery. They're here. Need any help, Kara? Never mind. Kip, look at these list of chores. We're never gonna get all this done. Sure we will. I've got shortcuts planned out for half of them. But Kip, your dad wrote follow directions exactly. I know, but what could go wrong, right? Look what the pet shop sent over for me to raise. Super rare dimple-cheeked fox turtles. Aren't they so cute? So cute. What are they for? What do you mean, what are they for? I mean, what's their purpose? What function do they serve? <sighs> They're cute, Finn. Their purpose is cuteness. They serve cuteness. Get my playset back together. <clears throat> Please. Everything's gonna be okay. Just take deep breaths. It's time to 
to stay really calm. I should have spent more time in Psalms, cause now I've got to go train my turtles. This is a true big girl job, to take an untrained turtle mob, to show the pet store I can train my turtles. One dream is there more to my turtle's purpose. I've got to be a big girl so I can make it in the world. Lord, I sure could use some help training turtles. Good job, Finn. <laughs> You're doing it, Kip. Training turtles. Yes, last cucumber seeds in the ground. Check that off the list. What's next, Finn? Balloon manure fertilizer. 1,000 time yield strength. It's time to read the accompanying 40 page manual with all the instructions, usage directions, safety regulations, complex chemical compounds, and... What? That will take forever. We've been out here all day. But we have to do it. You just sprinkle it on. But the directions? Way too long to read. But the rules? Take too much time. But the fertilizer? Needs to go on the seeds. Uh, so if a little's good, then a lot is better. Right? I don't think so. Don't tell Dad. I gotta go home! I gotta go wash my spreadsheets! Whoa, would you look at all this? I cannot believe how much growth we're getting here. Kip, you're a prodigy, my boy. A wonder kind, a vegetable kind. Ah, uh, that's great, Dad. Thanks. Too many, too many we use too much. Shh. I am so proud of you little cubes. You checked off a list and you must have followed all the directions. These are the healthiest plants I've ever seen. Thanks to you, I'll post these pics to my InstaCell account and wait for the orders to come rolling in. Oh, please don't thank me, Mr. Cubekin. Please. But hun, where are we gonna store all these cucumbers until they sell? No need to worry, my love. We'll eat what we don't sell. And these things will be selling before you can say... What could go wrong, right? <laughs> you betcha! This is Pris Pearson signing off from Big Box City with Four Square News, where we give it to you, Square. Did you hear that? About the fire in Big Box City that's left over 50 cubes homeless? 50? Isn't that the number of cucumbers we've had to eat today? Maybe the number of days we've been eating these things? I don't even live here! That's terrible, hon. I wonder what we can do to help them. Well, we could gather up our two small kids' clothes and send them. That's easy. But what to do with 50 hungry cubes? We'll have to pray on that one. James 1.5 says, If any are lacking in wisdom, they should ask God, who gives generously to all without finding fault. I'll pray with you, hon. Praying together would be perfect. God, our hearts ache, and we cry out to you. We pray 1 Kings 8.28 to you. Yet give attention to your servant's prayer and his plea for mercy, Lord my God. Hear the cry and the prayer that your servant is praying in your presence this day. Father, I could not say it better than that. Thank you for my wife and her heart. Help me to care as deeply for those in need. I desire to reflect your goodness and grace. Amen. Okay, boys, finish up your breakfast and hit the backyard. Those cucumbers won't pick themselves.
cliche, but I fear I've got the cucumber blues. Oh yeah. Gotta help out my dad, but I got the cucumber blues. I got the cucumber. Cucumber blues A whole lot of work That I can't refuse Lots of stuff to pick And I'm getting kinda sick Cucumber blues Oh yeah I got the cucumber The cucumber blues Oh yes I do Every time I pick one, five more go in its place. How many have we picked today? 5,574? 5,575? 5,576? I told you we should have read the directions. Yeah, I know, but there's got to be some way to make them stop. Is there? Not according to the directions, Kip, which we should have read before we... Yes, Finn, you were right. I was wrong. But right now, I really got to fix this before Dad finds out. He's so proud of me right now. What happens when he finds out I messed up? You know, Kip, you really need to tell your dad. Yeah, I know, but... But what? He'll be so disappointed in me. Maybe, but... But what? He'll still love you. So, any ideas on how we can get rid of 5,577 cucumbers? Nope. Okay, then we'll just have to do it my way. I just can't figure out why those cucumber plants are so blasted productive. I mean, I wanted a few of them for us, but I can't sell them fast enough. This is... Ridiculous? I was gonna say unbelievable. Even my poor little turtles can't eat any more cucumbers. I can't say I blame them. A balanced diet is the cornerstone to their good health. I don't think cucumbers five times a day is balanced. Well, anytime any one of you would like to take over the creation of new and exciting meals involving cucumbers. Everyone, please stop. It's my fault, okay? What do you mean, sweetie? All of the cucumbers. It's all my fault. No, 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 no. Kip. Kip, this is all my idea, not yours. No, you don't understand. I I used too much fertilizer on them. A whole box full. I wouldn't let Finn read the boy in old directions, and now we're drowning in cucumbers, and Kara's turtles will die, and it's all my fault. I'm so sorry, Dad. Kip, thank you for explaining what happened. I forgive you, son. I love you, Kip. 
no matter what. How's about we all pray together, huh? Our Father in heaven, you're mighty, great, and amazing. We're confused cubes who love you very much, and we could really use your help. We are covered up in cucumbers, Father, and don't know what to do. So, we're asking God. For forgiveness and what to do with all these cucumbers. For finding a purpose for my turtles before it's too late. For how to help the homeless. Thank you for the wonderful blessing of my sweet family, Father. Amen. I'm sorry that I snapped at you, Kara. And don't worry, your turtles are not gonna die. Okay, tomorrow's church, everybody, so let's get ready for bed. Uh, do we have to clean our, uh, plates? Oh, not tonight. And as Galatians 6, 2 instructs us, carry each other's burdens. And in this way, you will fulfill the law of Christ. We should totally do that. What? What Brother Ian said. Shh. Uh, better a small serving of vegetables with love than a fattened calf with hate. Shh. Huh? Proverbs 15, 17. When Ian read those directions from Galatians, he said we should bear each other's burdens, right? Uh, yeah. And you just said better a small serving of vegetables, right? Uh-huh. We can help others with all our cucumbers, don't you see? We are praying! And so, my brothers and sisters, I pray our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ keeps and protects you. Go and be the church in the world. You are dismissed in his love. Explain what you mean, Kip. I don't understand how our cubecumbers can help anyone. They can if we give them all away. But who would want them? Oh, yeah. Um, uh... I got it, I got it! Got what? Right here, right here, 50 homeless, hungry cubes! And they need food! They need cucumbers! Can I help? You betcha, sis. More than you know. Pearson here with Foursquare News and Little Box Boyg. Inspired by his past assignment and a helpful tip from his best friend, Little Kip Cubekin turned the problem of too many cucumbers into an assembly line of Christian charity. Well, the Lord gets all the credit for this idea, Miss Pearson. As I always say, if you want to hear God talking to you, just read the Bible out loud. Uh, I I'm not really sure how I helped. I just took really good notes on Brother Ian's sermon. I really gotta go to the bathroom. Finn made me head of logistics. I'm Kara, Kip's older sister. Church members are inside right now preparing cucumber dishes galore thanks to a bumper crop from local Ed Cubekin's garden. The boxes are then packed and loaded via an assembly line of specially trained, super rare, dimple-cheeked box turtles. All healthy and ready for adoption. The food is being sent to the Big Box City Homeless Shelter, where hungry cubes are looking forward to the banquet. Kip, this is simply an amazing story. What do you have to say for yourself? Awesome ideas can come from anywhere. If you're paying attention, then work really hard with your friends to make that idea happen for God's glory. And, 
And when you mess up, apologize, no matter what. Oh, and always follow, follow directions. directions. <laughs>